Hey guys, what's going on? It is Dylan back again with another showcase and review. And today I am excited to show you this product that I was sent by a company known as Telesen. And what I have with me today is the Telesen Dome Port. What is a Telesen Dome Port? Well, let me show you exactly what a Telesen Dome Port is. First off, you're going to notice that we have this grip. Now this one in particular was made for the GoPro Hero 9. At the time I'm making this video, that is the latest GoPro out on the market. Um, so it has this little cover. We're going to take it off. It's a nice cover that will keep this bubble right here from getting scratched up. So what this is, is if I turn this around, you will notice that uh, there's a place where a GoPro can go. It's got a waterproof housing. I'm just gonna take this off and take the GoPro out to show you guys what I mean. So here's my GoPro Hero 9, and here is some housing for that GoPro to go in. Whenever we put the GoPro in, the lens of the GoPro, there's a little open slot that it fits in perfectly. And then we can shut this back and close. Now what this dome port will do for you is whenever you are in a body of water, I about just by default said swimming pool, but you could be in the ocean, uh, you could be in a lake that is clear. Of course, this certainly won't do you any good um, if the water visibility isn't very high, if you can't see in the water very well. You wanna be able to be in some clear waters or semi-clear waters, and what this thing allows you to do with your GoPro is it pushes the water away from the surface of the lens. So if I turn this this way, you understand that the lens of the GoPro is basically flush with this ridge right here. And as you can see, this bubble, if you put this halfway down in the water, your water line is going to be pushed out away from the lens inside here. So what does that do? Well, that makes it very easy to get half above water and half below water pictures and video with your GoPro Hero camera. So it's pretty easy to understand how this would work. If you turn the dome port around, you will notice that there is a line halfway through it. And what that's gonna signify is your water level. You're ideally going to want to, let's say my hand is the water level, you're going to wanna lower this down to about that line and try to keep it there, whether you're filming or taking photos of a friend, of some you know, wildlife, say you're in the ocean, you got some coral and some beautiful fish and all that good stuff you're going to want the water line to be right there to match up with that line on the back and then of course you know you know how to work a gopro chances are if you're watching this you can take photos or you can take videos and um it, it's just super cool it makes it super easy to get those half underwater half above water photos and videos so without a whole lot more of talking let's uh let's go get in the water and i will show you guys some example footage while I'm waiting for my two-year-old son to get into the pool, guys, I did forget to mention, check this out. There is, on the bottom of this, it unscrews, and then you could actually put some, you know, some stuff in it. Chapsticks, sunscreen, some, I don't know, $20 bill. Um, it's pretty cool. It's got little O-rings right here on the lid, so it will be waterproof. And then also, the handle is built to where it is, you know, you could tether, you could tie, you know, like a string or lantern around your neck and hold on to it. And then it also has some threading down here to where you could mount like on a tripod or some kind of selfie stick or something for whatever reason if you want to. But as you can see here, I am fixing to start going down below the water a little bit. And again, you want to concentrate on doing the water level right at that line. And there you can see what we're getting so far. I'm going to try to get my son Bodie down here in the water a little bit more and get some, uh, you know, get some more shots. And guys, don't be critical of the, uh, the water. Um, there was a huge storm that just came through here not long ago. And you should have seen this pool about two or three days ago. Uh, it's just crazy um, what all the wind and everything like that did to the uh, pool water. So anyways...
So there you have it. There are the types of photo and video you can capture with your Teleson dome port. If you enjoyed this video, please be sure to smash that thumbs up button. Also, please be sure to subscribe as I will continue to have many more um, unboxing, showcase, and reviews of many cool products just like this one. And also, let me not forget to mention that I have included the links to this product in the description where you can purchase this thing. I would highly recommend it. It is a very cool product. As always, guys, I enjoyed it. Hope everyone's doing well, and we'll see you in the next video. Oh, 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 oh,